<laughs> so, we greatly appreciate uh, your presence, and, and obviously it is sort of something very important, near and dear to us. Uh, I won't belabor it. I'll turn this over to uh, Mr. Jim Nowak. Yes, please. Uh, good evening, members of Ridgeville Borough Council, uh, Mayor Betty Copeland, and uh, point, uh, appointed officials of uh, Ridgeville Borough, staff, members of the general public of Ridgeville Borough. It gives me great pleasure to be here and uh, to present uh, the Mayor of the Year Award. I'm the Mayor of Whitehall Borough and also President of the Pennsylvania State Mayor's Association, a position that I've proudly held for the last 15 years. And uh, I hope that means I'm doing something good for, for mayors across the state of Pennsylvania. Uh, with me uh, today is Mayor Keith Moss from Doria Borough in Lucerne County. If you don't know where Lucerne County is, it's all the way on the other end of the state next to, is the border in New Jersey? Does it border New Jersey? Uh, it's no, not. Close, close. is right in between Wilkesburg and Scranton. Okay, well, that's not funny. So uh, he, he is here. He's the uh, on our executive board. He's also chairman of the uh, Mayor of the Year Committee. Also, with two members of the executive board, one of whom is on the Mayor of the Year Committee. That's Mayor Heine Jean Martin. She is here from White Oak Borough. And uh, Mayor Dennis O'Keefe came down from Franklin Borough uh, to support uh, Mayor Copeland. I saw Ken uh, Lasoda, who is uh, the 2020 uh, Mayor of the Year, and uh, so he supported his uh, fellow uh, Mayor of the Years. And is there any other mayors that I missed are uh, coming in uh, that you want to identify uh, yourself? Okay. Um, Pennsylvania State Mayors Association is the largest association of mayors in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. We are comprised of boroughs, cities, and home rule townships. So we even have one uh, mayor on our board from a home rule township, it happens to be Whitehall Township, uh, in, which is in uh, Lehigh uh, County. Uh, we are not affiliated with any municipal association. As I like to say, we are an association of mayors, by mayors, and for mayors, and we provide a variety of services. We, we are the only uh, association that has a conference for mayors. Uh, we provide uh, education at that conference, also newsletters, uh, magazine articles. We provide legal services, and there's a great relationship between the mayor and the council because I haven't remember writing any letters for any Bridgeville or mayors. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> we also do lobbying, uh, on, you know, on behalf of, uh, of mayors. So, uh, in addition to that. We have an award, and it's the Mayor of the Year Award. It goes to an outstanding mayor, and we invite all of our member municipalities to nominate their uh, mayor. Uh, we maintain the applications for at least three years because uh, the nominators are passionate about that their mayor is the most outstanding uh, mayor. Uh, we try to be very objective about this, so we, there are six regions in Pennsylvania that the Department of Community and Economic Development has you know, designated, we adopted that, so we have a, a representative from each of those regions. Uh, we try to, we have at least one city mayor, you know, various borough mayors, some who are officers of our association, some who are just members of our executive board, and one person who is uh, not affiliated with the board at all, so we try to have a, uh, a diverse group that will make the best decision. And I know that they really work hard in terms of trying to, don't they, Ivan? And, and I mean, uh, he can talk to you a little bit about the process. So, uh, to me, this is the most prestigious award that Americans receive. If anybody uh, knows, uh, you know, what it means to be a mayor, what it means to be, you know, any profession. It's always the people of the profession that really have that idea. So when they pick a person to be uh, their uh, representative, uh, that's a very, very important honor. So I'm gonna now turn this over to uh, Keith Moss to talk to you about this year's award. Thank you, Mayor. Thank you, Mayor. Thank 
Thank you, Jim. Thank you, Bridgeville Council, Mayor. It's an honor to be here. I'm sorry I wasn't here for last year for the uh, Mayor of the Year because of all the COVID going around and everything. But uh, how the uh, Mayor of the Year Committee works. I'm the Chairman of the Mayor of the Year Committee. And this year we had 13 applicants. And out of the 13 applicants, we had a Zoom meeting and I asked them to narrow it down to three. On my committee, uh, Ina, Mayor Ina, Mayor Jim Sanders, Mayor John Granahan, Mayor Cashman, Mayor Scott Funk, and myself is on the, uh, the committee. And we have a uh, Zoom meeting. We usually have a telephone conference. And uh, this year, we had a Zoom meeting. So it narrows down to the, the, the three top mayors that we'd like to present with Mayor of the Year. And uh, I got to tell you, it, it was just a standout for Mayor Betty here. It was unbelievable. Mm -hmm. The uh, members of the committee and uh, the nominator that uh, nominated her. And I'm just going to go through a little bit of her nomination here that she was very surprised at the mayor's conference. <laughs> and, and I left out, you know, her name. And she was sitting there and going on and looking. Uh, and she was so surprised at the end, it was unbelievable. So to uh, move on here, um, Bridgeville loves Betty. This campaign slogan provided so true in 2017 when she defeated a primary election opponent as well as a general election opponent to be elected the first woman of mayor of Bridgeville. Mayor Copeland has also the distinction of being the first African-American mayor in the history of Bridgeville when she was sworn in on January 2nd, 2018. Betty Copeland is a well-respected, much admired pillar of our community. She works as a team with the Borough Council and staff. She is an encourager, and she is looked up to by the chief and the members of the Bridgeville Police Department, which she oversees. Mayor Copeland has brought kindness and cooperation to our community. She is a willing volunteer wherever she can be of help. She greets and welcomes new residents and businesses with open arms. Lately, she has participated in many drive by parades with the, with the police and the fire departments, recognizing children's birthdays and milestones of our residents during this coronavirus pandemic quarantine. Mayor Copeland has centered her volunteer life on the theme of certain leader. She remains dedicated to the creation of Martin Luther King Jr.'s concept of the beloved community. In addition to her mayoral duties, Mayor Copeland focuses on encouraging others to give back to our community by becoming involved in volunteers whenever and wherever possible. She is a true leader who leads by example. She has enjoyed serving the community as mayor and being a role model for other women, African-Americans and senior citizens who want to become involved in politics. Mayor Copeland was 83 years young when she was elected, proving you never too old to be involved to spread kindness and encourage volunteerism. At this time, I'd like to present to Betty. This is on behalf of the Pennsylvania State Mayor's Association, Mayor of the Year 2021 for the Distinguished and Mentors Service and Community Leadership presented to Mayor Betty L. Copeland, Earl of Bridgeville, at the annual conference of the Pennsylvania State Mayor's Association, July 17, 2021. Congratulations. Keeping me up to date on what's going on, and you're never shy to let me know uh, the latest in, in Bridgeville. 
Well, so I'm really appreciative of that. Uh, and before I forget, I, I would be remiss if I didn't mention Mayor Lasota. I, I'm fortunate I get back-to-back -back mayors, <laughs> mayor of the years here. So I feel, I feel I'm going to make some t-shirts and maybe we can, you know, raffle them off for a good cause or something. Uh, but Mayor Copeland, you, you are a Bridgeville persona high. You're a great role model for everyone in the community, and we're very lucky to have you. So I want to present to you with a house citation in honor of your Mayor of the Year award. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, Mayor Govan, I've known you for a long time through the Bridgeville Rotary. Um, I've known you as mayor, and then I was able to uh, pick your brain whenever I was elected to this position to see how I could help the borough of Bridgeville as best I could. And you've always been a straight shooter. You were always willing to help. You were always there. You answered all my messages and uh, you know, I, I I couldn't be prouder to be from Bridgeville. So I got this citation whenever I saw it on Facebook that you had been awarded Mayor of the Year. I, I wanted to come down and do something myself and the Senate was like, no, 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 you have to wait. We, we do this stuff, it'll come through our office. So <laughs> I'm just gonna read uh, this, this paragraph. Uh, whereas the Honorable Betty Copeland, Mayor of Bridgeville, the borough of Bridgeville is being recognized as a 2021 Mayor of the Year by Pennsylvania State Mayors Association. The Mayor of the Year Award recognizes elected mayors for their significant impact on their communities. Elected Mayor of the Borough of Bridgeville in November 2017, Mayor Copeland is lauded as the first African American and first woman to hold the office. She is known for her unflagging volunteerism ambassadorship and connections to organizations and members of the Bridgeville community, which helped the borough to obtain the banner communities in the state of Pennsylvania recognition. Any definition of a full and productive life must include service to others. Through her many initiatives to benefit her community and by her personal example, Mayor Copeland clearly reflects the true spirit and mission of the Pennsylvania State Mayors Association. Thank you. And to further pile on, we ourselves <laughs> have uh, something to say. Uh, I don't trust myself reading the small print over there. I'm going to do a brief from here and, <laughs> and then uh, present it to her. But this is a, a proclamation of the Borough Council of Bridgeville, Pennsylvania, recognizing Mayor Betty L. Copeland upon receiving the 2021 Mayor of the Year Award from the Pennsylvania State Mayors Association. Whereas Betty L. Copeland, a proud, humble, and strong leader, wife of Curtis Copeland Sr., mother of Curtis Jr., Lorraine, and Antoinette, and proud grandmother of Jude and Catherine, has unselfishly and devoutly dedicated her life to family, faith, and service, and whereas Betty and her family have given much of their time and talents to the many organizations that served the greater Bridgeville community, including the Chamber of Commerce, Rotary Club, local hospitals, Bridgeville Area Historical Society, Friends of Bridgeville Public Library, and the First Baptist Church of Bridgeville. And whereas following the footsteps of her late husband, who honorably served on Borough Council and its many advisory boards, Betty has answered the calling to public service and was elected mayor of the Borough of Bridgeville, taking office January 2nd, 2018. And whereas her election was a significant achievement for our community, as she holds with great distinction, as the first woman an African American elected as Bridgeville's mayor, an office where she has admirably and with integrity been a goodwill ambassador, advancing many successful initiatives to improve public safety in the borough. And whereas being a role model for all citizens of Bridgeville, Betty has earned a reputation of putting forth service above self and for her guidance of compassionate wisdom, and whereas making a significant positive impact on our community, Betty was nominated by her peers and was awarded the 2021 Mayor of the Year Award by the Pennsylvania State Mayors Association. Therefore, be it proclaimed by the Bridgeville Borough Council that she is congratulated for earning this achievement, 
And let it be known that as a community, we are beyond proud of her and directs that a copy of this proclamation be transmitted to Mayor Copeland and the best wishes for continued success, good health, and happiness be bestowed upon her. Approved in testimony whereof, we the underside and members of the Borough Council present this to you. recognition is not for being named the mayor of the year by Pennsylvania State Association none of this would be happening but I owe it all to these people because they're the ones that make me stand out and make me look good I'm grateful for all that we are doing for our residents and I pray that God blesses us all and gives us strength to carry on and do what we need to do to make Richville the loving place that it is. Thank you to both our representatives for being here this evening and for all of you for letting me know that I do matter, but you are, you are the people that inspire me to do what I am doing. Thank you. God bless us. Thank you. 